Human scabies is a pruritic skin infestation caused by the host-specific mite, Sarcoptus scabae hominis. It is a global public health problem, commonly affecting children and sexually active individuals. In this video, our main goal is to explore the common signs and symptoms of scabies. If you are looking for a more comprehensive lecture on this topic, please watch my previous video on human scabies. The link is in the description below. There are two main types of scabies, classic scabies and crusted or Norwegian scabies. Classic scabies is the commonest type. Here, there is little evidence of infection exists during first month. After about four weeks and with subsequent infections, a delayed type 4 hypersensitivity reaction occurs against mites, eggs, larvae, and feces of scabies. With reinfestation, the sensitized individual may develop a rapid reaction, usually within hours, leading to skin eruptions and associated intense pruritus, which are the hallmarks of classic scabies. Pruritus is worse at night. In adults, the lesions are commonly distributed in the following areas. Flexor aspect of the wrists. Interdigital web spaces of the hands. Axillae. Elbows. Wrists. Buttocks and genitalia. In infants, lesions are common in the face, scalp, neck, palms, and soles. On examination, affected areas may contain small papules, vesicles, and burrows. Burrows are a pathognomonic sign that represents the intraepidermal tunnel created by the moving female mite. A black dot may be seen at one end of the burrow, indicating the presence of a mite. Typical locations of burrows include webbed spaces of the fingers, flexor surfaces of the wrists, elbows, and axillae. Scabies nodules occur in about 7-10% to of patients, especially in young children. Crusted scabies is a highly contagious form of scabies. In this variant, hundreds to millions of mites infest the host individual. It manifests with marked thickening and crusting of the skin. In contrast to classic scabies, the lesions in crusted scabies involve larger areas, marked scaling is seen, and pruritus may be minimal or absent. Nail dystrophy and scalp lesions may also be present. 